Hello everyone. With me today on FaceTime is a fabulous Susie Ormond. Susie is America's most beloved advisor, author on personal finance. Welcome Susie. Thanks sweetheart. So happy to be here. So Susie, we'd like to start with your book, The Young Fabulous Broke, yes. right? Who is your target generation? My target audience was, you had just graduated, you, had, you were young, you were really fabulous, but you really had no money because they had more student loans than they could pay back. The employment is not there. How do you navigate through that? And what do you need to know to literally make more out of less money? So what are the takeaway there? If you were to boil it down to you know the top message, what would that be? That you have to understand what to do with the money that you don't have before you know what to do with the money that you do have. Here's what's so very sad. Nobody ever explained to the students what is student debt really for, because many people took out student loan debt to live, to go on vacation. If you have student loan debt, it's the most dangerous debt you can have. Even though they allow you to go in deferment, which means you can defer your payments, it will continue to compound and compound and grow and grow. So 20,000 will grow to 40,000, will grow to 80,000, and then they'll come knocking at your door. So the kids today are leaving with massive amounts of student loan debt. Your number one priority has got to be to get out of credit card debt. Why? Because credit card debt is bondage. You will never have financial freedom if you are in bondage. And if you are in bondage, you feel powerless. Here's the Susie Orman formula. Stop spending money that you don't have to impress people you don't even know or like. People don't judge you based on what you look like. It's an initial judgment. But make them focus on you, not your clothes. So show the you, not what you have. When you can't define yourself by the clothes you wear, the car you drive, your job title, the money you have in the bank, your credit card, whatever it is, who are you? Who are you?